In this video, you will learn how to copy Excel table into Microsoft Word document. You will learn three easy method. In first method, I will explain how to copy and paste static table from Excel to Word. In second method, you will learn how to link Excel file and Word file. And in third method, you will learn how to embed Excel document into Word document. So let's start this tutorial. If this video is helpful for you, then please like this video and subscribe our channel for more informative videos. Firstly, open the Excel file which contain the data. If you have multiple sheets, then open that particular sheet from where you want to import data into Microsoft Word document. After that, open a Word document. In first method, you will learn how to copy and paste static table from Microsoft Excel to Word. For example, I want to copy this table and paste it into Word document. Firstly, I will select this data. You can see here I have select the whole table. After that, copy this one. Open Word document. And here you will find the option of paste. Click on this option. Now you can see here the table is copied from here and pasted in, in Word document. But if you want to make changes in Excel document, then these changes will not be reflected in Word document. For example, if I change it to 290, press enter. And if I open the Word document, you can see here the data is not changed. Secondly, you can edit it or format it according to your requirement. For example, I resize it. I can change the values as well. Similarly, you can bold it. So in short, you can make any changes or format it according to your requirement. Now, if you want to import the data without formatting, you can also do that. For example, if I open this file, I will copy this data, right click, copy, open Word document, click here, right click, and from here you will find different paste option. I will select use destination style. It will insert table according to the default style of Microsoft Word without formatting. You can see here, this one is the table with formatting and I have pasted that table without formatting in Word document and you can resize it or format it according to your requirement. But this table is not linked to Microsoft Excel document. If you want to make changes in this table, then these changes will not be reflected in this one. That is possible if you link Microsoft Excel sheet with Word file, which you will learn in second method. Additionally, there is another method to copy paste static table. I will scroll down. Now go to insert option. And in insert option, you will find the option of object. Click on this. And in object, select create from file this option. Through browse option, select the file from where you want to import the data. Go to desktop. And I have file graph tutorial to select this one and just click on insert again click on ok wait for one to two minutes and your data will be imported to word document you don't need to copy that one and paste it in this one you can use insert function now come to second method in which we will learn how to link excel file and word file firstly i will scroll down Open Excel document, select the data, right click, copy this data, open Word document, go to Home tab, 
and here you will find the option of paste click on this arrow sign and you will find the option of paste special select this one from here i will select paste link in third method you will learn how to use paste option that is also useful option to embed excel document into word document for time being i will use paste link I will select Microsoft Excel. From here you can see here it is also selected the source Microsoft Excel worksheet and it is the sheet name is Preto and the range of cell is given here. After doing that just click on OK and your table is imported but this table is linked to your Excel file for example if I minimize it and also this one now you can see here if I make changes in this table for example I change it to 390 press enter now you can see here this value is automatically changed because these two files are linked now if I change this 40 to 140 press enter now you can see here this value is also changed. So this is the second method. I will explain another version of this method. I will click here. Now go to insert option. I will again use insert option. And from insert option I will again select object go to create from file as previously selected firstly i will select link to file option then go to browse option select the file which contain the data graph tutorial 2 select this file click on insert option and click on ok now you can see here the data is imported into your word document if i double click on this then that particular file will be opened remember that if you have linked the microsoft word file with microsoft excel file then you have to keep both these files if you want to send this file then you have to send both excel as well as word file otherwise link will be broken if you have deleted the excel file then this link will be broken and you cannot make changes you can use another useful method that is to embed the microsoft excel document into word document in which you don't need to keep the source file or you have to send this file with excel file to someone so let's learn third method in this method you will learn how to embed excel document into word document i will click here go to excel file select the data copy this one open word document click here I will I want to paste it here now go to home tab and here you will find the option of paste I will again use paste special option select this one when you open this one as we have done previously then we will select Microsoft Excel worksheet object select this one and here we will use the paste option previously we have used paste link to link these files and in this method we will use paste option to embed that particular data in microsoft word document click on ok now you can see here the table is inserted here but this is not ordinary table the data is also embedded in your word document if, if i double click on this file then you can see here the whole excel sheet will be opened and you can make changes in it and later on these changes will be reflected in your word document for example if i insert another figure here which is 70 press enter and double click here 
now you can see here the changes are reflected in this table so by using these methods you can copy the data from excel and paste it into word document that's the end of this video thanks for watching this video goodbye